Look good on your lunch hour. Sponsored by the Advanced Cosmetic Surgery and Laser Center. Good afternoon once again. If you're headed for a procedure soon, there's something you might want to consider. The NIH says it's sort of a preconditioning to healing. Joining us now to talk more about it and look good on your lunch hour, Dr. John Mendelson at the Advanced Cosmetic Surgery and Laser Center. Good afternoon to you. You are using this new hyperbaric chamber, so tell us what this is. Yeah, so a hyperbaric chamber is a <clears throat> pressurized chamber where patients are breathing oxygen. And what it's doing is it's increasing the blood, the oxygen concentration within the blood. And what this does for our uses is it promotes healing. So patients will do some dives ahead of their surgery and some dives afterward. And uh, what studies have shown is uh, up to a 75% uh, increase or in recovery, decrease in inflammation, bruising and swelling. And uh, the reason for this is the oxygen concentration is up to 1000% greater than normal being under this atmospheric pressure. All right, so let's show a little video. Can you explain to me how this works? We kind of see someone getting into this sort of yeah. large uh, ours, couch. Yeah, ours isn't the easiest chamber to get into, but you can see you, you, uh, you climb into the chamber, you can see Dawn in there. And after a few minutes, uh, the atmospheric pressure, sort of like scuba diving, uh, increases. So you might need to yawn or swallow so your ears don't get plugged. But uh, as you can see with Dawn, you can take your phone in there. You can, uh, it's difficult to have a conversation because it is somewhat loud, but you can do some work. You're quite comfortable. Usually our dives last anywhere from 60 to 90 minutes. Uh, my, personally, I've been in there for longer periods of time. There are other uses for this in terms of improved cognition and other anti-aging effects. Um, a lot of the elite athletes will use these for recovery from, from muscles. But for us, you can see, Don, there's not a lot to do in there. You're there for about, like I say, an hour to 90 minutes, and uh, we decompress you, you climb out, and that is, that's it. You can go right back to your normal activities immediately. Uh, excellent. Okay, final thought. I know you were including this as kind of the surgical cost and whatnot, but are you finding that patients are really doing better when they use it in advance and then afterward? Yeah, we are. This is this is something that's been tested. You know, we used to use it for uh, non-healing diabetic ulcers, let's say for, for in the hospital. Uh, smokers have a greater risk and decreased blood flow to their tissues, so this has been used. So this is nothing uh, new. It is newer to the cosmetic surgery world. Uh, there are patients who may have risk factors who historically we would send somewhere else to another chamber just to prepare them for surgery. So yeah, it's absolutely uh, legitimate and very helpful in terms of overall recovery. Yeah, always helps to have everything you can for healing. Dr. John Mendelson, thank you for joining right. us. We want to give people a quick phone number if they want to reach out to you, 513-351-3223. I know Dawn's getting a facelift and we look forward to seeing her before and afters. Thanks for your work. Yeah, we'll be happy to show it. Thank you. Thank you, Liz. Have a great day. You too.